This over here is going to be our, our grooming tables and grooming room. For two years, Natasha Kirsch, executive director of Epic, has worked to gather money and resources to turn this vacant building on Troost into a dog grooming school. I was working with a group of addicts and alcoholics. Most of them were single parents that had three or four kids. Most of them had a felony, dropped out of high school. Hard pressed to find them jobs, she realized there was a field in high demand right here in Kansas City. And then sinks are going to be back behind that wall. Kirsch says professional dog groomers make an average of $19 an hour, and the Kansas City market is really in need of them right now. Alyssa Hammonds, a dog groomer here at Eagle Animal Hospital in Riverside, says there isn't a day that goes by in her work week where she isn't all booked up. Some people come in every week, every two weeks. If approved by the city council on Thursday, the school will teach all necessary skills in six months, skills that can also be used to better their families. Part of our training is that compassion towards the animal, the safety with that animal. That that will start to bleed over on their children as well. The school will use a combination of city grant and federal funding to train 18 people each year before sending them to work in grooming salons and being self sufficient for their families. Our goal is that once they get out of our school and get six months of experience underneath their belt, that they can just get off of welfare. No more food stamps, no more housing, no more childcare, that they can do this by themselves. In Kansas City, Keisha Henry, KMBC 9 News.